Hello. Right, Chris here at RD Tech. Um, just an update really on the channel. Um, I've been very busy with real life jobs. Um, another thing I do is shop fitting. And with lockdown and such, um, a lot of the shops are closed to the public, so they're getting a lot of their stuff done at the moment. So I've been quite busy with that. Um, so I have got um, two or three videos in the works at the moment that just need editing. Um, and finding that time for that with editing what with work and the kids and family life and things um that's just take, been a little bit tricky of late um so what videos we've got coming up we have got this marshall jcm 800 uh which has had a, a wee mod to it service and a mod that one's coming up um also what else have we got we've got This amp here, Matt Amp GT1. That's coming. That's all done. Um, customers waiting to collect that one again. Collections have been difficult, what with lockdown and stuff and movement and such. Um, uh, this is just one of my amps. Um, under here is H and H. Uh, this one's been languishing on the pile because the customer. That's a ton of amps, and it's just one of those things that sort of do. When I can, um, I'm actually that what stalled that one. And if anyone who watches this does know where to get them, I'm looking for plastic long plastic shaft pots because um, the chassis is quite deep, and finding those pots has been a bit tricky. Um, I need about two or three of them. Um, I've looked in some of the usual places, but anyone who's got any help, that would be really cool. Um, hidden in the back, there's my JTM 50 build. Um, I know I put part one up on that. I need to do part two again. Finding time. My neighbours have just had a baby, so that one's going to be noisy. So again, it's finding time to do that one. Um, well, so oh, hidden down here. There's another one that's sort of um, hiding away to be done. Uh, I think you might have seen this one on my Instagram account. That's a Marshall PA Master PA one hundred. Um, that one came from, oh, I can't remember which country, um, I think it's Bulgaria. Um, that one, what's been putting me off that one is that's had some field modifications, so we say. Um, where that lived most of its life, martial parts were pretty hard to come by. So someone had field repaired the output transformer. So again, it's one of those jobs that's not massively urgent. But um, I need to get my brave up to tackle that one. Um, what else have we got in here? What's coming up? Um, so what was the other video? Uh, yeah, the video is the Matamp and the 800. Uh, that's my uh, 1987X converted to 204. I will need that sort of couple. Have I done any mods to that one? Any minor ones? I need to do a video for that one. I will do a video of all my of my stuff as well um i've got plans for that boogie studio which that runs into the pv classic 60 budget mark 2 c plus and i'll be doing a video with probably those two guitars and i think you can guess what the video will be about um this is my jet city jca 100 hdm um, the face panel I painted uh, about two days after EVH's death as a little tribute. Um, I've always liked the tone on the For a Awful Carnal Knowledge album, which was an SLO 100. I've got the parts in. There'll be a video on that. I've got the parts in to do the SLO mod to this. Um, this is essentially a Soldano Hot Rod 50 and there's about four or five component changes to turn this into an SLO. As close as you can get for the money um, and I don't think they're gonna be making these anymore because Soldano are now back in business um, I don't think they'll have the rights to do use a circuit anymore so I can imagine these going up in value soon but yeah we're gonna convert this to proper SLO specs and see what difference that makes um, that's it really um yeah so this video just an update and obviously YouTube if you don't regularly put videos up they um punish you on your um algorithm um 
number one. Love that guitar. Um, yeah, so that's it. Uh, have a lovely weekend. Um, or whenever you're watching this. Uh, and I'm back off to work tonight again. Um, yeah. Love you all. Take care. I'll speak to you soon.